Hello and welcome back to another Minecraft video. I am Leafstar360 and we are on Forest Craft. Yeah, this has been the fourth time me trying to record this episode. So, we're on the fourth episode and I did something between, I did a lot of things between episodes. First off, I got a little bamboo farm, as you can see behind me. Um, I also, things look a bit more cleaner, and there's no chests, I move the anvil. And the anvil is actually new, I haven't used this anvil at all, pretty much. And like, I have, oh, also have bamboo in there, and I have a chest down there. That's because, yep, I have sorted my inventory, and as you saw behind me, also moved my, what do you even call it, another portal, back a couple blocks so I can have a little, another portal room right next to it as well. Now, probably, do you notice anything weird out of ordinary about how I've sorted it? Probably not. See that and that. Then you also see this. My head. Now, normally, how you get Minecraft heads is through commands. On, but I don't. But I don't have, like, I don't have cheats on this world. So how could I get it? That's because if we take this out. It says they saw 360's head, so this wasn't a mob technically texture, something like that. It's because I installed the <laughs> really stupid idea. I've started. To, I had two extra. These are gonna be the only two. I'm never. I'm not gonna add any more data packs to this world. What I have right now is perfect. It's my perfect thing. But basically, I have. If it once you get a player kill, you get at least star 360. So whenever I want, or you get your head. So you see, oh, actually doesn't say it. Oh, also I have better F3 installed on my. So basically, if you have a like, if you want to get your head in sync player world and you have this data pack, it has to be a data pack. The only way to get it is by in single player, it's taking off all your armor and shooting yourself. <laughs> and so you do it, and then you kind of like that. And without armor, also without fire protection, it does a lot of damage. Okay, so that's the data packs. And now we should probably move on the episode, but let's just explain. I've been trying to record this episode for over a month now, and what has happened is I have died. Yep, I have died, but I did get all, I did get some, I did get my armor back, but it doesn't have the same enchantment, so... I still have my diamond helmet blast protection full. It's it's because I, I wasn't wearing it when I died. I was in the nether. Whole new whole different story. I'm gonna explain a bit later. So then I have fire protection three, a breaking three on here. Protection three, unbreaking three, and unbreaking three protection four on my armor. Then I have efficiency four and silk touch, no breaking. Sweeping edge, unbreaking three, and fire aspect two. No sharpness. Efficiency four, unbreaking three axe. And efficiency three, fortune two, and efficiency five. Now, I was trying to do what I did last time. I got fortune two again. But I wanted to get fortune two or fortune three on my pick, as long as with efficiency four and or unbreaking three. Because then afterwards I can combine it and then all that stuff. And then I could, when I combined it, I could easily just hit, 
I can I can get efficiency five and fortune three on my pick, but I didn't really get it. Now you might be wondering, like, why why do I have this and just one lone chest over here? Sign above it called prep chest. So I've had this um, way of storage, pretty much, and you might have seen it, but heard of it, but basically you haven't seen me label a chest like it. So basically, whenever I'm doing something to upload the game or do something, just something in general, like, game more further along with the, like, moving on with how the game, like, works, all that stuff, I will have, what I normally have over here, also have a prep chest. Now, you see, I have this, just in case, um, I don't get, like, an efficient, I don't get a, um, fortune three just in case I this one's almost runs out and I don't and I want fortune three so I want to get fortune three on this fortune two is just see that seeing fortune two on that is just sad but I could I could just enchant that that would be good but just fortune three hopefully even if it's efficiency four I don't know but also I have 14 face powder and one and the pearl. Now this is where the story of how I lost everything. So basically, I found the Nether Fortress, of course, but I went to go my. I went to go mine for. I went to go, not mine, but kill Enderman to get Ender pearls, but I had sixteen. And place powder and still 14. So basically what happened, I had everything on me besides my helmet. Literally everything on me. In the end, I got tunnel vision and I died in lava. But this the morning of recording this, I decided I I needed to do something. So after so basically I got everything sorted and today I did something. There's no time lapse to for this, by the way. Well, and the link, the link to the tutorial video, is going to be in the. This is in my design, but the link to the t video tutorial video will probably be in the card above in the in the description down below as well. Also, I trapped a. Trapped the more villages and the houses. Also, this took a while and a lot of rage crits. I rage crit it once and I had to. I went to walk my dog, all that stuff. But. I have finished the iron farm. Yep, it's all done. Now, the breeding bit of it is, isn't yet done. But. It's better than none. And also, I have AFK'd for about an hour and a half. About more like an hour and 20. And this is how much iron I got. That's a lot. If we take out the poppies, don't contraptions now. Um, I also need to, I'm probably gonna make like a bone meal farm. I already have, no, I don't really need it. But this is like also really good for getting red dye if I want ever want, need something for red dye but yeah I now have an iron farm you can see how how this farm works so what ha no how How did th what? No. No 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 no. Okay. So I got a step, so I'm gonna have it have them follow me up here. So yeah. <laughs> that was I got that. 
sorted. Okay, I'm gonna see you when I get that zombie. Okay, um, it looks sunset. It's about sunset, and while it's the sun setting, I'm doing this. I and I just want to tell you something absolutely awesome that happened just last night. So it's crazy, absolutely crazy. And you might be wondering why I've been trying to. So. Basically, while you, while you are, um, like, having, when you do stuff, like, with shorts, like, I've made a couple of shorts, like, probably three of them, and all I've done is just, like, on my phone, click, click on one of my YouTube videos, at, just, just do something, get to a point where I really like a funny moment. I really like and I edit it oh my goodness yes yes I have already found another husk I have my name tag okay so let me explain how this happened so basically with shorts the thing is it people always I know a lot of people watch shorts like oh my goodness it already subscribe Oh, let's go another end pole. Hello, and well, not actually. No. Uh, let's restart this. <laughs> okay, so when the world, I just realized I see something that should be impossible. Oh my goodness. This was gen this world was generated in 1.19. This shouldn't be possible. Yet it is. It's actually quite close to spawn too. Yeah. As you see right behind me, here is my base. Kind of. So, as you see, I kind of am working. This is going to be what my base... This is what my base is going to be looking like, kind of, without, like, the sand. Because I'm trying to clear out the water. See what it look out like without thing. This tower will not is not going to be here. I'm deciding that these the areas are gonna be like um, agricultural farms most likely. And thing to do. I was listening to a pop. This right here took me about half, like three to four hours to do in creative mode, mind you. In creative mode, when I have infinite sp sponges and infinite sand. I don't have an infinite spoon chisel, infinite sand any right now. In survival, this is gonna take like forever. What have I just signed myself up to? Also, by the way, I don't know if this is gonna be where my nether portal is. It's just a concept. I do like it though. This, honestly, instead of a thing, this might just be like a, a switcher going up and down. Instead of having these here, and I'm just gonna have like 
But I also, but the thing is, I do want to have something like this. Where it's, you go, you basically go down here, and then you also go up. This is my favorite thing. But, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this is definitely not my final say. Okay, so now that I've seen that the build I want to do I'm going to first I'm gonna need to make some calculations of course and this is gonna take a while but I'm gonna start on the most the innermost circle like pre I'm just gonna like create it and then have a little like area and then oh but I also need a floor I used white co concrete in the actual in the test but honestly sh should I just have like a place a holder item as like dirt or um I'm going to make the inner circle first without like the inner bits just to make the inner circle first and then probably underneath I'm gonna like put some sand put a little floor in like kind of underneath and put some sand up making that an empty space but I I do need to get the outer circle done as well and I don't want to do it that in this episode right now I just want to get like that I want to do the I want to do a lot of this on stream, but I want to get the, I want to get started in this episode for this. So I'm going to need to make a lot of deep say tiles, but at first, let me just make, let me just do some calculations.
Okay, so I made the circle. It was actually harder in as you might have thought as you might think because I messed up. You probably saw on the thing. What happened? So, as I head back back home, I would just like to t tell you thank you so much mo thank you so much for watching. It really meant a lot to me that you guys are uh, watch that you guys decide to click on my video and see what I'm up to in my survival single player world. I have so many good plans for for this world and I really hope I'm able to get it get it all out and honestly I won. I can't wait. Honestly, I can't wait to want out twenty because I have so many good ideas for for it. And you see how I got a bamboo foam going and yeah. But I'm just really excited for that. See what's going on. Hanging signs is gonna be so like really nice to have. So yeah. Um thank you for watching. I am the Star360. And if you did and if you did like this video and you want to see more f of me and you ha and you aren't subscribed would you please consider it i know i i know many p youtubers ask this but honestly i am it, i am really just yeah and also give me some suggestions down in the comments down below and also some q and a's as well maybe i can get some q and a's also maybe just maybe i will have um a short coming out as of recording this today i need to get one out because i've just realized what need what's the best way to <laughs> i to get yeah I need to get a I need so yeah thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next episode of Forcecraft or in the next shorts or in the next video so goodbye see ya okay now why why are you still here if you're still here I mean, why are you still watching? The video's over. Click off. Click off now. Click off now. Okay. <laughs> Bye. Don't be a stranger. Bye.